Hello and welcome. In this video, we will work together to understand a few functionalities of the Rule Builder tool. We will learn how to add rule statements with appropriate selections, add reference tables, validate, test, and compile. Let's consider the following scenario. Create a business rule that determines whether product information is valid using the following logic. Product description comprises of brand and model information and is valid if both are valid. Brand has to be in uppercase. Brand is valid if it matches one of the values listed in the reference table of brands. Model is valid if it is not null and matches one of the values listed in the reference table models. Let's get started. Log into the Informatica Analyst as Administrator. From here, select New, Rule Specification, enter a name, a description, and click Browse to select a location to save the rule. Location field specifies a project in the model repository. Save. Rule now opens in the Design Workspace. Select the primary rule set shape and rename to product. Click the plus sign twice to add two new rule set shapes. Let's rename these rule sets to brand and model. Select the brand shape from properties, select the inputs tab and click to add a new input. String for data type and a maximum length of 25. Select the rule logic tab and click add a new rule statement. Is not for operator. Now value, function, convert case, convert to uppercase for input brand. Let's add another rule statement using the result of the first. Click the arrow here and select the second option, add rule statement using result. Is within for operator. Click to choose a reference table. Select reference table car brands. Kindly note reference table brands and models have been pre saved in this folder. In value and enter valid. Now select the model shape, inputs, click to add a new input, spring for data type, and a maximum length of 25. Click the rule logic tab and click to add a new rule statement. Model. Is not null value. Let's add another rule statement, but this time the third option add condition. Model is within. And let's add the reference table models. Spring value, valid. Finally, let's configure some rule statements for the product shape. 
Click product. Rule logic. Click to add new rule statement. Brand is for the operator, string value, valid, add a rule statement with the add condition, model is for the operator, string value valid, then string value is valid. Let's add a couple more rule statements. Brand is not string value valid, then string value will be invalid. And the last rule statement model is not valid, then string value will be invalid. Save the rule specification. and click validate option here to validate the rule. To test the rule, select the test tab and type in your test values. Click test rule, the rule outputs will be populated here. After you test the rule, compile the rule to create a mapping in the model repository. Click the arrow here and select compile. Compile functionality helps create a mapped object that other users can work on. This concludes the demo. If there's any feedback you'd like to share, please do email us or tweet us at the following addresses. Thank you.